Kinda Kinks is the second studio album by English rock band The Kinks, released in 1965. Recorded and released within two weeks after returning from a tour in Asia, Ray Davis and the band were not satisfied with the production. The single Tired of Waiting for You was a number one hit on the UK singles charts. Production The album was recorded immediately after the return of the group from an Asian tour, and was completed and released within two weeks. Consequently, the production was rushed and, according to Ray Davis, the band was not completely satisfied with the final cuts. Due to record company pressure, however, no time was available to fix certain flaws present in the mix. Ray Davies has expressed his dissatisfaction towards the production not being up to par. Commenting on this, he said, a bit more care should have been taken with it. I think Shell Tami went too far in trying to keep in the rough edges. Some of the double tracking on that is appalling. It had better songs on it than the first album, but it wasn't executed in the right way. It was just far too rushed. Releases it was released by Pi in the UK on March 5, 1965, and by Reprise in the USA on August 11, 1965. The US release had a rearranged track listing and repackaged cover. Several tracks were removed, and the single Set Me Free, released two months after the UK issue of Kinda Kings, was unique to the album's US release. In the UK, the album was only released in mono. No stereo mix was made. The single Tired of Waiting for You was a number one hit on the UK singles charts. The album itself hit number three on the UK album charts. Wonder Where My Baby Is Tonight was released as a single in Norway and Sweden in 1966, backed with I Need You, reaching seven on the Swedish charts. Reception Olmasik wrote that the album was uneven, but that what was first rate was also highly memorable, and what wasn't also wasn't bad. They also made note of some maturing in Ray Davis's songwriting. Track listing, all songs written by Ray Davis, except as indicated. Equals UK release equals. Equals US release equals, side 1, Look For Me Baby 217, Got My Feet On The Ground 214, Nothing In The World Can Stop Me Worrying About That Girl 244, Wonder Where My Baby Is Tonight 201, Set Me Free 212, side 2, Everybody's Gonna Be Happy 216, Dancing in the Street 220, Don't Ever Change 225, So Long 210, You Shouldn't Be Sad 203, Something Better Beginning 226, For the US version, three tracks were dropped, Nagin Woman would be held over for. The US only Kingdom LP, and both sides of their recent hit single, Tired of Waiting for You, and Come On Now, were already placed on the previous US album King Size. These were replaced with the recent single Set Me Free, and Everybody's Gonna Be Happy. Personnel, The Kings, Ray Davis, Lead Vocals, Backing Vocals, Rhythm Guitar, Piano on Wonder Where My Baby Is Tonight, Dave Davis, Lead Guitar, Backing Vocals, Lead Vocals on Got My Feet on the Ground, Nagin Woman, Wonder Where My Baby Is Tonight, and Come On Now, Pete Quave, Bass Guitar, Backing Vocals, Mick Avery, Drums, Additional musicians, Bobby Graham, drums on Tired of Waiting for You, Razor Davis, backing vocals on Look For Me Baby, Dancing in the Street, Come On Now, I Need You. Cover versions, Something Better Beginning was released by the Honeycombs as a single in 1965. Tired of Waiting for You was covered by The Flock on their first album The Flock in 1969. Everybody's Gonna Be Happy was covered by Queens of the Stone Age on the limited edition version of their songs for the Def album. Queens of the Stone Age also covered, Who'll Be the Next in Line on their Stone Age Complications album. Come On Now was covered by the Pusher Willows on their 12 EP, Spring Fever. And by the Plimsouls on their album One Night in America. I Go to Sleep was released by Peggy Lee and the Apple Jacks in 1965 and was covered by Cher on her debut album, All I Really Want to Do, and by The Pretenders on their album Pretenders 2, and by Sayar Furlow on her album Some People Have Real Problems. Tired of Waiting for You was covered by Green Day for the Howard Stern movie Private Parts. It also appeared on their 2002 B-Sides compilation, Shenanigans.
nothing in this world can stop me worrying about that girl was covered by Mark Lanigan in 2000 for the Kinks tribute album, Give the People What We Want, Songs of the Kinks. More recently, it was covered by Solvents on the Wes Anderson tribute album I Saved Latin. References